We can't fix it, but only a child is small enough to fit into its mechanisms. Alternatively, a steam core could be used to shunt some pressure from the damaged assembly. This child will probably die. Discontent will rise greatly. Hope will fall greatly. We will use one steam core, discontent will rise. We can do it. The generator will blow up, our city will die. <laughs> well, let's use a steam core. Why will it blow up though? It's it I I kind of forgot that it was in overdrive, but it's not even close to being at a hundred percent overdrive. Yo. I do not agree. I I do not agree. Okay. Oh, hold on. We gotta pause this here for a second. There's a few things happening right now. I think we finished some research. Now we reset research the sawmill. <laughs> we are doing all the wrong things, man. All the wrong things. We gotta start this. Alright then. Let's build the sawmill for Christ's sake. Turns frozen trees into usable material, producing up to 80 wood per standard day. Yeah, I gotcha. It probably needs... Oh, hold on. Hold on. These frozen trees? Oh shit. Oh no. Yeah, we should build it right here, but... Can we do that? Can we just build it? In the middle of nowhere? I am not happy with this. I don't think this is gonna work. But hey, it's too late now. Oh, I might, I, I might just let the automaton work here though. Then maybe the cold isn't gonna be a problem. Alright. We researched something else? Yeah, we did. Alright, we did that. You guys gotta work a little bit... A little bit harder, okay? Please. Shit, man. You guys don't understand. We will all die pretty soon. Unless we figure something out here. Foreman. Appointing responsible foreman will make sure that people work as efficiently as possible. After intro. Oh, okay. New ability foreman increases the efficiency of a workplace for 40% for 24 hours with no negative side effects. I will cost food. A foreman will ensure that everybody at this facility works at the best. You will have to provide the foreman with food. Hmm. It doesn't do anything for hope though. We are losing hope guys, we are losing hope. Might do some moonshine. Yeah, let's do moonshine first, because discontent is is uh, climbing up again. Let's get him drunk. Make him forget their uh, pains and their worries. Yo, automaton, dude, 
I told you to come here. You are working there, bro. Alright, see, we just got two sick people just because some people ran out there to build this sawmill. My god. And it's cold. Inoperable. Alright, hold on. Automaton! You stop doing that. And you start doing this. Town is getting big. Yeah, it is. A little bit. No. We are getting there. Slowly. Slowly getting there. But you, look, 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 look. Coal is a real, real problem for us. We only have kids available to work. Shit. Yo, what happened? What happened? No. We can't have kids. I might reduce some of the, some doctors here. I think if we do 3-3, three, three, we will still be okay. And then we can... Put some more... Oh, 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 sorry. Not here. We will put them in there and max it out with the kids. 3 workers here, 8 workers there. We can probably even that out now. Something like this. Alright, let's uh, give this a try. I mean, we are really, really running out of coal. And we, we need twice as much. We actually need twice as much. Damn. First runs are always difficult. <laughs> there are so many things to understand and master. And the game has no mercy. Yeah, you're right. You're right, like the the generator almost blowing up. Like there was no reason for that at all. You know, we were in overdrive, but we were at like 80%, 70%, it wasn't that bad. And then it just kind of decides, you know, hey, either you sacrifice a kid, or you have a steam core, or uh, the game is over. Yeah, thank you for that. Where are you going? Oh, they are hunters. Going to rest after the hunt. Oh, they're coming back. Okay, I thought they're going out. Gotcha. Hope is still a big problem. Now, I don't know what broken promise they're on about. I, I did not break any promises, dude. God damn it. Some alcohol, a brothel, some free fight, and everybody's happy. Yeah, except they're kind of happy, but they're not very hopeful for the future. Right, they are kind of happy. But that's that. There's no goal, there's no vision for the future. Alright, the frozen grove buried shame. Poking around the trees marked with crosses, we found shallow graves under each of them. The dead bodies lack most of the bigger muscles, and some bones bear signs of a cutting tool. The corpses have been obviously stripped of edible parts. That's a sentence I never thought I'd read out loud. Now we know what kept the survivors by the freshwater springs from starving. We'll leave, gra we'll leave the graves intact, but we can cut the trees for wood. Take the trees. 
Yo, do they actually have like unlimited inventory space? You know, coming from Tarkov, that's uh, something I can't believe. But it looks like they're just wandering around here. You know, we never have to go back. <laughs> and then they have like 5,000 food and, and coal and wood and then they just die out there. And we'll never get those resources. That's exactly what's gonna happen, isn't it? Let's go. Let's go now. What's happening with the sawmill here? The automaton's already working there? It is, it is. It's got a recharge though, okay. Whoa, 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 what happened? Generator power upgrade researched. Alright, that's pretty cool. So, hold on. They will use up 21 per hour so we should make 24 or 22 per hour gotcha these guys yeah we unlocked the upgrade steam level 2 which is turned on which is turned on okay no we cannot turn this on yet We have to build up our coal resources and wait for the for the very cold time here. I mean it's it's still chilly. God damn it. Like this should hold on. Oh it needs to build up okay, okay. Now we will just use steam level 1 for now, but as soon as day 21 hits us and we will go down to minus 60 degrees, we need to use level 2. And we need coal for that. We need coal for that. I hope that's gonna work man, I hope it will work. All right. A new research thingy. What shall we get? Materials. How does that work? Allows us to use heaters to heat workplaces during working hours. Each heater raises a workplace's temperature by one level and consumes one coal per hour when running. It only says workplaces though. Oh, you know what? Why this is imp important? We, we gotta do this. Because there's no other way that we can heat this one up. Other than having the heater running. I mean, now that we have the automaton working there, we kinda don't need it. But there might be other buildings. That are outside the, the heat radius. Okay, maybe we could have waited for this. I'm not sure. Anyway, now it's too late. Let's research it. Food, I think we can do a little more here. And something happened, something happened. A few are persuaded. A member of the Londoners is talking to a crowd. He's trying to scare as many as possible into joining the exodus to London. But his vision of doom ring false in the ears of people who are content with the situation in our city. What? So if we let him speak, the number of Londoners will rise. 
And we can't do the others. Ah, okay. We gotta let him speak then. So 25 people already want to go. Come on, man. Fuck it, though. I, I got 25 people coming in. You know, just leave. I don't need you. You're all gonna die going back to London anyway. They will be back soon. We might have to build the tents now. Let's see. You're right, 25 Londoners, but 1 billion refugees coming. <laughs> no problem. Yeah, I mean, they still have like, what, 12 days? So maybe that number will rise significantly, but... You know, I don't think we need to worry about 25 people. <laughs> Thank you for leaving your homes. Yeah, we almost worked them to death and then we, now we got, you know, fresh ones coming in. So I think this is best for all of us. Captain, someone has defaced the walls with predictions Jesus, of doom for our city. This is troubling. People already fear will share winter homes fate. And scared minds are swayed by even the smallest nudges. Hope will fall slightly. Oh, okay, the, the, there's only bad options, so let's choose the lesser evil. Our hope is absolutely fucked. I don't know what we can do. What do you do? What happened? Why is nobody working here? The fuck? Yo, honestly? What what happened? Requires at least one worker. We totally put workers there. We put all our engineers there and all all the kids. Why did they stop working? Did I misclick something? Did, did we just lose like a whole day? Where we didn't get any coal? Oh man, that sucks. We need this. We need this badly. Oh, steam cores, food and wood. Wow. But it says someone lives here. Hmm. What's happening? The refugee from Winterholm. The man we've seen from afar was nowhere to be found. Searching his burrow, we found a diary of a scientist who fled Winterholm. After the starving city fell into chaos, its leader, an army captain, appointed himself an absolute ruler. He tried to impose order using force. Huh. That's kind of what we're doing, right? Plenty of people disgruntled, deserted the city, and most of the others rebelled against him. That's what might still happen to us. Let's take the resources, and I'm thinking we go back. Like, this is a lot of resources that we have. I'd rather go back, maybe get couple of the closer ones and then we can go for the for the far ones again four hours for these guys to come in let's get ready gotta build two tents let's build two tents let's start out with two tents there we go And oh, that's it for now. Can we build anything that will increase hope? Like seriously? 
increase hope. I guess not. Heaters! Use heaters to heat workplaces during work hours. Yeah, but how, how does that work though? There we go, the heater is off. Raises the workplace temperature by one level while there are people inside. Alright, alright. But this is okay, right? Chilly. There's no people here, so this can be cold. Where's the overview here? Oh, this one is cold. Look at that. This one's not cool. But we should turn this one on then. It's the only heater that's running. Everyone else is okay, right? I mean, they soon won't be when when the, the terrible cold hits us. But for now, they're all good. All the resources for us, yeah. I, I wonder what they're gonna bring back. Look at that. Food. Coal. I wish it would be a little more coal, but... Oh well, I'll take that as well. Good. Reminder to quickly save the game. Something's gotta happen with our hope. I don't know. Maybe, maybe when these guys get here and you know they're not all dead, then maybe that will give us a little bit more hope. Four cores, yeah. I don't really know what to do with these cores, but I'm guessing it's a good thing, right? It it kept our generator from exploding once, so it's not a bad thing, I guess. more uh, scouts resources the, yeah this we could do upgrading coal mining hold on we have a big problem with coal allows us to build coal mines extracts up to 240 coal per standard work day Ah, oh, it requires a steam core. There we go. I was just asking. Uses intense heat to char up to 70 wood. Mm -hmm. Producing 210 coal. Uh-huh. Wall drill. Drills into the walls of our crater, uncovering trees that once formed a forest before the ice engulfed them. Oh, this is how we're gonna get wood later on, huh? A few hardy crops can be grown here, supplying up to 30 raw food. Well, Strangely enough, we don't have a food problem now. Bunkhouse. A dwelling for 10 people that is adequately protected from the weather. Ah, real houses. Okay. That's not a bad thing to have. My, my guys are still living in tents. I might go with the coal mine first though, because coal is such a big problem right now. You know, we can place the coal mine o over here. And uh, I don't know what else is connected to coal mine. Do our people still have to go over there and, and pick up the coal? Because that wouldn't be so cool. Ah. Get back to work. Go ahead and work, my workers. 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Survivors reached the city. Sir, a group of survivors has reached our city. They are tired, they'll need a place to rest, a bite to eat, and perhaps some medical attention. And then they better get to fucking work. So nobody died? Did nobody die? Oh, we have 17 homeless people. Oh, because these are not built yet. Alright, gotcha, gotcha. Yo, instead of being homeless, better build your, your tents. Jesus, do I have to do everything for you guys? I'm not your babysitter. I'm, I'm the mayor of this beautiful city. Or what could, could one, one day become a beautiful city? Let's build it. I, I don't know what it does. I hope it was a good idea to build this. I mean, we seriously need coal. We are actually good on food rations again. It's so weird. We were starving and now, you know, they can just eat like the good food. They don't even need to eat the soup. Jesus, that's loud. Alright, let's have one kid working there. How about a new law? The guard stations? Probably not bad, right? The foreman, not bad either, considering we have food at the moment. It will increase the efficiency for by 40% for 24 hours. It will just cost some food. Uh, let's, uh, let's build some guard stations, though. Listen, everyone. New law is the new law is here. And it is a guard station. Which is kind of an upgrade. I hope. I guess that's why I upgrade on the way. Yeah. Yo, that means the bunkhouse is also just an upgrade for this, for these tents, right? I don't have to tear these down and build them, build them up again. That is cool. I like that. New research though as well. So we got the coal mine. We might do the the research, the depot, the depot. Or the range. Or the bunkhouse. Yeah, bunkhouse. Not too bad. We don't have any steel though. After, after we deplete these forty three steel bars we are out of steel maybe it's time for this extract iron ore from deep deposits and processes it to deliver up to 40 steel yeah i think we need this right like this this four resources really coal wood steel and food and we have three of them now but not the steel so this might be this might be necessary. We have one more sick person. Yo, we got some engineers. We can we can fill up our hospitals again. We could also say now that there is no children working there, right? I mean, we, we don't really have to let children work unless we have to. 
Steam cores. We have just used our first steam core. Steam cores are a necessary component in advanced technology. We can't manufacture steam cores in the city. So let's hope that our scouts find them during their expeditions. And find them they did. Luckily.